here we are at Doncaster College. Uh, we are doing a level one diploma in painting and decorating. Now, one of the uh, one of the tasks that the students have to do here, they have to apply paper. Now, applying paper is a bit of an art form and it takes a lot of practice. So, I'm just going to give them a quick demo because I want these lads to see how they're doing and to see how it's done. Right. So, I'm going to have a quick demo going around this window. Quite a difficult task, this one. We've had young Harrison down here who's already pre-pasted this for me. And I'm gonna show you, attempt to put it on. Uh, hopefully Harrison's put the paper on straight. So, we get his hanging brush and we keep us scissors in our pockets. Also have the pencil, all right? And we open up one fold at a time. So, same procedures again, gents and ladies. Left hand as it is. Put it into place, and then you get your hanging brush out, and you brush it into place. We are not cutting any paper at this point. All right, get it into place, brush on the end to hold and support it, and open up your next fold. Now, when we get to here, when we get to here, we have to again find the corner, stick a pencil mark in, get your scissors and cut from your window, but I want you to again cut beyond, about a centimetre beyond your pencil mark. And that just gives you that little bit of movement. Again, support it, open up again, and brush out the air. We are not squeezing the living daylights out of it. We are not pushing the paste out of it. We are just helping it to stick. Open up the next fold, and we're just brushing the air in. Uh, brushing the air out, sorry. And then your last fold again, open it up and put it into place. Again, find the corner of the window. Cut out again. About a centimetre beyond. Now this is the worst part here. Now Harrison has just gone out a little bit, okay? So we need to adjust this so we can move it. We can pull that down. But by moving it down, we're going to get a crease in it. So by not cutting it, it gives us that little bit of scope to manoeuvre your paper around. All right? If we'd have cut that, we'd have been thrown out all over the place. And again, brush it into place. And then it's the same procedure. Pencil mark down and cut it. Make sure you cut your pencil mark off, right through your pencil mark. <coughs> pencil again, down to there. Pencil across there. And by making sure that we cut an extra centimetre through, means that we can pull it back, pull this paper back without ripping it. And you just pull it back slightly. We're not dragging it fully off the wall. Up your paper up. Push them into place. And then the last bit down here. It's a little bit off this one because the paper was put on before. It's uh, just run out a little bit, so it makes it a bit more difficult to keep it running true. If you ensure that your first piece of paper is straight, then every piece of paper will run straight with it. If you bend your first piece, you bend them all. Okay? At the end of that, get your sponge and wipe off the surface. Wipe off all the excess paste. And it doesn't hurt to get the paste off the face of the paper if there was any on it. Now some of you will get down here and if you've got a big bit overhanging, 
get rid of it because the weight of it will pull it off and it will start to rip and that's what we don't want.